Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So today we are going to be showcasing the new Space Traveling Warriors category team on Global, led by the STR Full Power Bojack. Now, recently I've been hearing a lot of people talking trash about this unit, and I think it's just absolutely ridiculous, man, because he's actually really, really good. And all the people who are calling him trash, saying he's bad, telling me that I wasted my stones summoning for him are just straight up wrong, okay? So today with this video, we're gonna put an end to all of that and show people just how powerful this guy can be. So yeah, with all that said, let's just jump right into it. For some context, my Bojack is currently at 79% with, uh, you know, slightly leveled up links, but nowhere close to maxed out. And the rest of the team includes a 69% LR Bojack, a 55% LR Turles, AGL Turles, 90% Tech Sangya, STR Topo, and the friend Bojack I believe is only at 55, yes, 55%, and uh, his links are pretty much comparable to mine. So you can also kind of think of this as a 55% Bojack versus 79% Bojack comparison video. So there's that. And uh, yeah, anyways, that is the team. Let's jump into the event and get this showcase started. Uh, ooh. Yo, we actually got like the perfect rotations, man. This is pretty much exactly what I wanted. We got the LR Bojack with the STR Bojack. We got the other Bojack with Sonya. That's awesome. Okay, so let's give uh, just two orbs to the STR Bojack. Let me check his defense, actually. Uh, 153,000. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. And the LR Turles, or not Turles, uh, LR Bojack has 153,000. And the LR Turles has 198,000. At 55%. That's pretty crazy. So this entire team is just, uh, you know, pretty freaking tanky, even though we don't have any like stackers nobody here infinitely stacks defense but we don't really need it when you have 150k to 200k on the first turn right so yeah defense is looking good offensively uh, i know a lot of you guys <laughs> weren't super impressed by that attack stat okay but let's put things into perspective here number one bojack works very similar to the str transforming cooler where before he transforms, he's primarily a support unit. So we can't expect him to do, you know, too much damage. You know, he's a great support unit who overachieves, I think, on offense. And then, once you get that transformation going, that's when he becomes this offensive juggernaut. So just hold on tight, you know, just wait for a few more turns and we'll get to it. So let me see these guys' defense now. Uh, yo, Sonya at 155,000. That's that's quite impressive. Uh, 122,000 for the 55% uh, Bojack, and then of course only 69,000 for the Turles. Um, you know what? I'm gonna actually put Turles there. <laughs> I know he has the worst defense, so you're probably wondering, like, yo, why are you putting him in front of the most attacks? And the reason is because. I really want to get big bad bosses going. I want my Bojacks to have big bad bosses for this showcase as quickly as possible, so uh, I'm actually kind of praying that he gets supered here. We'll see. Okay, so we took 16k there. Mmm, come on. The one time, the one time I wanted AGL Turles to get supered. The man doesn't get supered. I mean, come on, like, almost every other time for every other event where I brought him, I'm like, yo, just super anybody, just don't super Turles. And Turles, for some reason, is always the one that gets supered. And now, I want him to get supered, and he doesn't get supered. Of course. That's cool. So, <laughs> now we got the uh, Topo support, 159,000 defense for... SDR Bojack, 162,000 for the LR. Um, let's just give one orb or two orbs to my Bojack here, and the LR will get a 18 key super. 
and here we go. His damage should be slightly higher, but not by much. There we go, 2.14. Uh, once again, guys, overachieving support unit. Overachieving support unit. What's this super gonna do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> 82. Nice try. Nice try. Ah, <sighs> You know, one thing I do love about the STR Bojack is the fact that he's brought back the LR Bojack in a big way. You know, like a lot of people were not running the Int LR Bojack before STR Bojack came out. And now, if you pulled the uh, STR Bojack, then obviously you gotta run him with Int LR Bojack. So like, he's kind of really, you know, gave this guy some new life. Uh, okay, once again, we're gonna try to take some damage with the AGL Turtles. There are two attacks in the middle. So we're gonna leave him there and just really, really pray that, uh, you know, she decides to super right there in the middle. Oceanus, do it. Do it. Okay, so there's a normal. And uh, wow, look at that, man. LR Turtle is getting 6.3 mil. 55% once again, guys. 55%. Now, if we had... I was gonna say, if we had, uh, you know, a 24 key super, just gotten one more key, it would have been effective against all, but it doesn't really matter, right? Cause we, we crit. So yeah, great damage output from LR Turles. And I was saying before, like I'm not the biggest Turles fan out there, but this unit is actually making me love Turles a lot more just because uh, I love the unit so much. Okay, so now we can use the active skill, and I think I'm going to. Yeah, let's bop it, let's bop it. We're not going to be able to get big bad bosses, but we can start stacking his attack now. Because once he transforms, just like the STR cooler, uh, he stacks attack every single turn. And it, it, it's funny, when people like talk about the two, they're like, yo, <laughs> STR Bojack is literally like that meme you know, when, when compared to like the STR cooler, you know that meme is like, uh, yo, can I copy your homework? It's like, yeah, just uh, make sure to change it a little bit. Like that's literally what Bojack is. He is STR cooler, you know, like a copy of STR cooler, except they changed him just a little bit, you know, just enough where it's like not exactly the same, but it's very, very, very similar. Okay, so we got almost four mil attacks that here. I'm not sure if we got big bad bosses. I don't think so. I think this is without big bad bosses. Additional super, 4.2. We could potentially get a third super, but of course she's dead. So only two supers this turn. <laughs> uh, so some good damage, <laughs> some good damage. Hopefully people are starting to understand what I was talking about before. Uh, I'm gonna put the uh, Turles there. I mean, we got two Turleses. I'm gonna put the AGL one there to hopefully take a super. And come on, guys! Like, just just do it one time. Just just let Turles get supered once. Yo, when did this man become such a good tank? When, when did AGL Turles become such a great tank? Like, I know he has type disadvantage, but his defense has always sucked, man. And it's like, <laughs> I remember him always taking like 50k for a normal, and right now he's tanking for double digits. Doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense to me, guys. All right, it's fine, it's fine. You know what, I'm gonna stop chasing for this, uh, this big bad bosses. It's my fault. For not maxing out my Turlesses, or my Bojacks rather, uh, Big Bad Bosses before the showcase. And uh, it's gonna happen naturally. It's it, it's gonna happen naturally. Okay, so we're looking at 227,000 defense. Not to, wait, hold on. When, when did we take so much damage? I swear our HP was still like at 400k, I, okay. So we have big bad bosses. We have some support from the friend Bojack. We got six orbs for that full passive. And look at that guys. A hey, 4.9 mil for a super here. Hopefully we get a few additionals. There's the first. Additional normal. And he's dead, okay. If he hadn't died, we potentially would have had 
a second super because I did give the guy, I think, 22 additional in his hidden potential system. I can just check, actually. I don't, I don't need to guess. All right, let's see. So he has... Uh, yeah, level tw no. Oh, only level 12 additional. I guess that makes sense. I thought I went with the same build as I did for STR Cooler, but it's because Cooler gets the guaranteed crits against pure Saiyans or hybrid Saiyans, right? And this guy doesn't, so uh, I think more crit is still better for him. All right. This is going to be a bit of a gamble. Um, I'm going to leave AGL Turles there. Obviously, his defense is really good uh, after the transformation, 177k. But we still do have type disadvantage, so I think it's going to even out. And if we get supered, we'll take like maybe 100k, 150k, get big bad bosses. <laughs> I know I said I wasn't going to chase it, but yo, screw it. Uh, get big bad bosses and, you know, get some nice damage next turn for the Bojack. I don't know why I'm pushing so hard, man, for, uh, for people to respect Bojack. I think maybe... The reason is like, I I actually really like Bojack as a villain. Like, I like him more than the average person. We'll go with that. Like, I, I think he's quite underrated. And for that reason, I want more people to recognize just how good this uh, unit is. Like, I think a lot of people just assume that he's trash because he's Bojack. You know, they haven't like really given him the time they haven't really like used him too much. They're just like, oh, it's Bojack. He's he's probably trash, right? And I'm trying to I'm trying to show people, man. Like, nah, he's not though. And also, of course, it's a team showcase. Like, I know it seems like it's just a Bojack showcase, but the team is really phenomenal too. Like, this is easily one of my favorite teams in the game to run right now. And the main reason for that is probably because. I mean, we got a bunch of monsters on this team, but also I love how like almost everybody on this team is a support unit. You know, like we got the two STR Bojacks who are supporting before transforming, of course. We have, yeah, okay, yeah, there we go. This is what I was talking about. This is what I was talking about. We have the uh, STR Topo supporting. We have the uh, who else oh AGL Turles of course we got the STR Turles with support too so like literally five out of the seven units on this team are our support units and that is a big reason why I, I really enjoy running this team so yeah uh, we got a token attack here uh, did I need to use an item I don't think so I think I think we're fine without an item this super might hurt a bit not as much as I thought it would, actually. All right, so some good tanking from LR Turles. Let's get this token attack off right. Oh, whoa. How did I miss that? I swear I clicked it, guys. I, I swear I hit it on time. It just decided to not register it. I can't explain it, but <laughs> that, that should have been a perfect token attack. It's all good though, it's not a big deal. Oh man, LR Terrorless, such a beast. Such a beast. I, I still stand by my original statement. Uh, I do think he's better. And and this, I think, pissed off a few, peop a few people. Uh, I think he's better than LR Jiren. And no, it's not because I'm salty about LR Jiren. Uh, for those of you that watch my channel regularly, you know I never pulled the tech LR Jiren. Like it was, it was a pretty rough banner for me. But that is not the reason why I say Turles is better. Okay, there's a multiple, multitude of reasons. Like, offensively, I think he's comparable. Um, he gets this active skill that can be used twice. He can stun. He has the support. That's 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 a big thing over Turles. The, the, the support, right? Like, wait, no. Did I say like, over Turles? That's the big thing Turles has over Jiren is the support. Because... Um, not only is he, you know, a monster in his own right, but he's also making the rest of the rotation, the rest of the team better. So I think that's pretty key. Alright, we took 139k there. That's actually not terrible. And we get big bad bosses. So that actually worked out. That's good. 
And yeah, we're getting over 5 million pretty consistently right now. Give me one more super. Never mind. The normal was enough. Okay, so I think we have two more stages here, right? I think we got two more. I don't know if I really want or need to finish off this event. So I think once we kill Sinchen Ron, we're just gonna call it a video because you guys get the point. Okay, uh, Bodak's a beast, Turles is a beast. This team is just mad fun. Although if I wanna really show how crazy this team is, maybe I should no item this this event, this stage. I think that might get the, the, the point across even better. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, I'm not sure if you guys saw, but the next Dokkan Fest unit. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't say this because it depends on when you're watching this video, right? But if you're watching this video around the time it's coming out, uh, the next Dokkan Fest unit on JP is the uh, Super Saiyan and Kid Goten and Super Saiyan Kid Trunks. And dude, the animations for those kids, insane. I mean, the one with the Krillin, too. Like, my boy Krillin finally gets him respect. Um, so good, man. So, so clean. And I wasn't even that hyped for the unit when like I first heard about it. I was like, you know, go ten and trunks, sure, or whatever. But like, like they just don't really do much for me, right? But then I saw the animations and I was like, okay, I take that back. I need this unit right now. And it's like not a question of whether or not I should summon for them. It's a question of like, how many dupes do I go for? So if you guys are summoning for them, they are dropping in a couple hours from now. Best of luck to you. Uh, I hope you guys pull them within a very reasonable amount of stones. And uh, yeah, that's all I gotta say about that. Okay, so this should do it for, there we go. This should do it for Sinchenron. Now we got the Omega. And this guy's gonna be a little bit tricky. This guy's gonna be a little bit tricky because he is uh, AGL. And we have some STR guys. We have, we have three STR guys actually on this team. I'm a little bit concerned, I'm not gonna lie. Um, we obviously have to leave the STR turtles in the middle. I would have put Zangya there, but she was locked up. So let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. I'm not gonna use an item because the whole point of this is to no item to show you guys the superiority, <laughs> I guess of this team. Sonya getting about 2 million. Some solid damage there. The additional uh, additional normal attack. SDR Turles over 5 mil. We have type disadvantage though, so we really need to crit to do any real damage. Yeah, we didn't get the crit. Although we're tanking normals. Tanking normals well, I like that. Oh, ouch. Oh, we're dead, aren't we? <laughs> I think we're dead. AGL Turtle is gonna get us killed. Oh, 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 no, we're still alive. We're still alive. Okay, um... <laughs> what do we do here? What do we do here? You know what, screw it. I'm not gonna use an item, because uh, I want to keep big bad bosses. So here's what's gonna happen. Okay, if it's meant to be, then we will kill... Omega with the two Bojack. If it's not meant to be, then we're just gonna die. And I, I can live with that. I can live with that. Okay, there's the additional. Damn it, okay. So we need uh, LR Bojack to do some good damage here. I don't think he's going to be able to kill him though. Oh yeah. Well, as long as Topo doesn't get supered, we'll still be good. Yeah, we're still alive. I wonder how long we can, like, <laughs> last like this. Um, hmm. <sighs> Yo, we're probably gonna die. Yo, screw it. <laughs> I'm popping a Princess Snake. <laughs> we almost no itemed it. We, we came close. Came close. If we got a little bit lucky with the RNG and uh, we're able to get like 
one additional super that crit for the STR Bojack, it would have been over. It would have been over, we just didn't get lucky like that. So instead, we're gonna pop the item. Um, if we take a super now, it should be fine. Should be, is the keyword. And we're gonna finish this thing out. We're gonna, we're gonna close this thing out. I didn't want to initially, but we're this close now. Might as well. It'd be a shame if we just died, like, you know, so far into it. And you know what? If Zhonya actually gets an additional super here, that might be. What is up with all these additional normals, man? Every single time there's a normal attack, there was a 50% chance it could have been a crit. And we're just not getting that that roll. Alright, it's all good. It's all good. This is gonna be the last turn, guys. Bojack is gonna finish things out like the beast that he is. Uh oh. Hmm. Well, I do not wanna leave Turtles there, that's for sure. Uh, okay, screw it. Yeah, let's let's break them up. We're gonna break them up, uh, and then Turles will probably clean things up if the STR Bojack doesn't do the job. Uh, this should be fine. Should be fine. I'm not worried. I got faith in him. I believe. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh! There we go! Okay, yo, those normals are deadly, man. <laughs> those normal attacks can be pretty freaking deadly. Like, what, what did that one crit do? 1.3 mil or something like that? That's like a that's like a Vegito uh, counter, man. That's like an LR Vegito counter. That's crazy. Alright, so we had to use one item. It, 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 was, it was unfortunate. I really wanted to no item it, but what can you do? Things don't always work out the way you want them to. And uh, there you go, guys. That is the showcase of the Space Traveling Warriors. Of course, you can do some other combinations, but this is the one that I prefer just because I love all the support units. Um, I love the Turlets combo. I love the Bojack combo. Obviously, you got to have that for the team. And uh, yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about it. Uh, has this video, can, okay, let's say you're one of those haters out there that I was talking about, one of those BoJack haters. Um, has this video convinced you otherwise? Has it changed your mind at all about the, you know, uh, about the status of BoJack? Because I think he's easily a top 10 TUR in the game, uh, possibly even top 5. You know, he, he's at least knocking on the door for that. And for all those people that, you know, didn't give him the respect he deserves, let me know if this video affected your opinion in any way. And that's it guys, that is gonna be today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, as always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.